I think there is a resurgence of uh, craftspeople. People are appreciating handmade goods, and especially handmade goods um, made in the U.S. I've always been someone who works with my hands a lot and enjoy making things. I began working with leather because I had a wallet that I loved and I used it until it could no longer be used. And I decided I would try to make one myself. And so I took an old cowboy boot that I found at a thrift store, cut up the leather and used a hammer and nail to punch the holes, sewed it up. It was very rugged, but it, it still exists today. And then I slowly ventured into working with vegetable tan leathers and just learned from books. I took a shoemaking course in New York City for a week. I apprenticed with a shoe repairer and he showed me quite a few things. So that kind of helped me in um, my knowledge of just working with leather. I think a lot of my stuff is a simple design. It's a very clean look that I strive for. With leather, you can't always get perfection. And so I think kind of embracing those imperfections, each one of these is gonna be um, different and unique. I think there's something to be said for things that are made by hand and that make it an interesting piece. Make it feel like it's been loved a little before you receive it. I hope that customers who buy a Jepson Leather Goods piece, I hope they get a one-of-a-kind piece that they love dearly and are able to use it and keep for the rest of their lives.